Hello, and welcome to another Sporty's Product Pirate. My name is Chris, and we're currently on the second floor of Sporty's cafeteria area, overlooking the beautiful runway with aircraft taking off. But today, we're gonna talk about a flight simulator rig from Real Sim Gear. Right here behind me, we have the Cirrus setup. We've got Keaton with us, who's gonna talk to us about some of the cool features or aspects of this sim setup and uh, educate us on what it can do. So Keaton, Thanks for joining us. Yeah, thanks, and, Chris. Uh, what are some of the cool features or things you like to highlight when someone's interested in this? Scenario? Yeah, so this configuration, uh, there's a couple important features that are included in anything to this level of fidelity. Uh, we got our force feedback side stick, full leather stitching, replica throttle quadrant, GCU stack, full replica avionics as far as the PFD and the MFD, custom uh, real sim gear software, so we can do that for both Perspective Plus and Perspective. Uh, we have an Avidine setup for it as well. You've got a leather stitch seat that's adjustable. And this configuration, as seen here, can be sold as both non-approved as a BATD, and with the addition of a CAPS console, you can actually get it approved as an AETD as well. What type of customers do you usually work with who are interested in something like this? Is it maybe a brand new student or, say, an aircraft owner? Yeah, so it's a wide variety. Um, I think a level to this system, it's designed for home use. Um, it can be used in a commercial setting, but on the home use side of things, whether you're someone that's just going through their PPL, learning the Perspective Plus keyboard for the first time, trying to go through your initial flows, all the way up to someone who's instrument rated, maybe they own a Cirrus, they don't fly it as much as they want, they can actually log their currency in the system. And then on the, the other side of that, if you're going through your instrument rating, you can log a bunch of time on the system toward your instrument rating and save time there. But I think that ultimately the system is used to amplify and enhance your training that you do in the actual aircraft by recreating a bunch of repeatable scenarios at home. I love the setup. The side stick of a Cirrus is always a challenge to me. The majority of my time is in a Cessna. Mm -hmm. Are you able to create profiles or simulators that are up to this level of ability for different types of aircraft? Yeah, so at Real Sim Gear, uh, obviously we have the Cirrus. We do everything G1 Cirrus through the G7, even the Vision Jet, um, but outside of that, this level of fidelity system um, in a modular panel, both on a seat and frame or a platform. We can do it for Cessna, Piper, uh, Diamond, or really any G1000 based aircraft. We also do custom panels, so if you have an aircraft out there you're looking to get a sim for, custom avionics, some sort of custom plane, uh, we can do that as well. That's really great. That's cool. Well, thanks for joining us today. Uh, this unit itself, along with a couple other configurations that Keaton just mentioned, will be available online, so if you'd like to learn more about this type of setup or some of the other offers, uh, please visit sporties.com or realsimgear.com to see all the cool designs and ways you can create a simulator that'll work for you. We thank you for tuning in and we'll see you next time.